Hey, welcome back guys, General Tony here, coming back with a brand new Clash Royale episode. So we are actually going to do something very fun inside of this video right now. We're going to do a collaboration with another YouTuber, and we're going to do a girl vs guy deck, guys. And then we're going to switch it around, so I'm going to start with a girl deck, he's going to use the guy deck. Then I'm going to use the guy deck, he's going to use the girl deck. And then we're going to go in for a final live attack, where we both use the exact same deck. So let's see if we can set up this live attack inside of here. How do I do this, guys? Here we go, friendly battle. So it's me and Master Saint, can you beat me? And uh, yeah, let's just leave it as, guys. Let's do it, let's do it. Can you beat me? Let's see if he's ready to rock and roll. So we got our deck ready. We'll wait for him to come and join. So just whilst we wait for Master Saint to come and join, don't forget we are doing the 600,000 subscriber giveaway in just over a week's time. So if you want the chance to win part of $250, all you need to do is to leave a like and subscribe to this channel to enter. So don't forget guys, if you do want to check out Master Saint's channel as well, there is a link in the description box down below. Why is he taking so long? Let me let me drop him a message. So as I said, this is a head-to-head -head challenge myself against Master Saint. And what I want you guys to do just before we do get into the first live attack is go down below in that comment section and let me know who's going to be the victor. Who is going to take the victory? Now it is a best of three. As I said, it's girls against guys, then guys against girls, then girls against girls. So it's going to be a very, very easy challenge, guys. Hopefully... We can win it. It's very simple, not easy, sorry. Hopefully we can win. So if you think I'm going to win, then come and hashtag General Tony down below in that comment section. And if you think he's going to win, then come and hashtag Master Saint. So let's get this battle started. So here we go, guys. He has just accepted the challenge. So we have an all-girl battle deck. We've got the P.E.K.K.A., the Three Musketeer, the Witch, and the Valkyrie locked and loaded already. Let's check this out, guys. So he's got a guy battle deck, of course. It's going to be a very cheap deck, which he has. And I think mine's going to be a lot more expensive, quite simply because the girls are just so much more expensive inside of the game. Now, the one weapon I am planning on using, which hopefully he's not really going to see, guys, is the uh, is the actual three musketeers. So let's see if we can take him out using a few of these gold cards. So here we go. He's dropped in the uh, the minions on the right-hand side over there. Hopefully, we can arrow card here. Check it out, guys. So the arrows are about to go down to take out both of his troops. The pecker is still up and running. The archers are going to get a couple of shots off. And the, uh, the princess and the musketeer are actually in there on the left-hand side. And I've done a little bit of damage already. So he's got the little goblins coming in, which is cool. So he's already done some damage to my tower. I've done a little bit to his. But we got the P.E.K.K.A. there. Now, I'm not going to use the P.E.K.K.A. again because she just costs too much elixir for what she's worth inside of this, guy. So we're going to drop down the level 2 witch at the back here. Now, the witch was nerfed. Sorry, was buffed. Oh, you cheeky little bugger. So the witch was actually buffed, guys, a couple of days ago by Supercell. And now does 17% more damage. So hopefully... We can take out this mortar before it gets a shot off, guys. There we go. Can't let it get another shot off on the witch. That's awesome. That's awesome. So the witch is still alive. Hopefully, we can do some more damage to this tower on the left-hand side. And Master Saint is going to go down. So the witch is still alive, but she just goes down there. So don't forget to let me know in that comment section who's going to win. Is it going to be myself or is it going to be Master Saint? Master Saint sucks, guys. Come on, let's get this going. Let's get this going. So we got the three musketeers ready to roll. But hopefully, we're going to use that as a surprise card very shortly. So we're going to drop down the one musketeer at the back there. Here we go, guys. So he's got the uh, he's got the giant coming in. Okay, we're in we're in serious trouble here. The royal giant is going to uh, really annoy me here. So here we go, guys. Going to drop in the three musketeers. They're going to take out the uh, the ice wizard instantly. And of course, they are still all up and running. Going to chuck in the uh, the musketeer. Sorry, not the musketeer there. The uh, the Valkyrie. We're getting splash damage done by this stupid mortar, guys. Here we go. Check it out. So the uh, the princess is still alive. No one's really done a massive amount of damage yet, but he has he is beating me by quite a bit. He keeps dropping in this stupid mortar, guys. There we go. The mortar's going to get dropped down again. So we're going to use the musketeer to try and counter the mortar as quick as we can before the ice wizard steps in and takes me out. We're also going to drop in the witch, guys. Here we go. There goes the, uh, the, the royal giant once again. There's only 20 seconds left inside of this battle. We're going to have to risk it, guys. We're going to risk it for a chocolate biscuit. Three musketeers going in on the right-hand side. Check it out. Can we take the tower down? No! Come on! So yeah, it looks like we're going to lose this one, guys. It looks like we are going to lose this one. Yeah, okay. Okay, so I suck at this. But don't worry, we're going to go in for a second attack. This time, we're going to switch it up. He's going to use girls. I'm going to use guys. So let's go and build ourselves a second deck. So we're going to make a second deck, guys. Let's go in here. Let's change it up. So we're going to use a very cheap deck this time. So we're going to use the, uh, we're going to use the Royal Giant. The Hog Rider counts as a boy as well. Let's just use a very simple deck, which we know can win us the, uh, get us the victory. So the rules are you have to use six cards, and then the other two last cards can either be a spell or a rocket or an arrow card. So we're going to use six cards. We've got the Goblins, the Hog Rider. We've got the, uh, got the Royal Giant there. We're going to keep the Zap spell. 
We're going to bring in, actually no, we're going to use the minions, in, sorry, the arrow card instead of the zap spell there. And we're going to bring in, what else can we bring in guys? Check it out. We're going to bring in the minion horde, should be, uh, should be pretty decent. Where's the minion horde at? There we go, guys. Minion horde coming in. We've got the uh, the fire spirits. We're going to keep the fire spirits. We're going to drop out the miner and the princess, of course. So we're going to bring ourselves some barbarians. And then the final card is going to be... What should we bring as the final card, guys? You know what? Let's bring the guards. The guards are pretty cool. So there we go. It's just a random deck, to be honest with you. So we got the hog rider, the royal giant. Now, there's no way we're going to lose this. So here we go. Let's go and set ourselves up for the second challenge. Let's do this, guys. Here we go. Here we go. So he's at 2,674 trophies. He should have a girl deck ready. Hopefully, he's not cheating, guys. Here we go. Let's see what he's got. So we got the guy deck rock and rolling ready to go. Gonna drop down the royal giant straight away and send in the fire spirits just behind. He's got the princess going in on the left-hand side. Fire spirits gonna do damage to the tower straight away. He's already down to 1,300 hit points, guys. This is the beautiful thing about the guy deck. The guy deck is so much cheaper compared to the girl deck. Girl deck's very expensive apart from the... Uh, Apart from the Princess and the Archers, I think they're the two cheapest cards. The rest of it's so expensive. So we're going to take out his Musketeer. The Barbarians are going to head towards that tower on the right-hand side. And he's already in a lot of trouble, guys. But we're going to try and embarrass him here. We're going to try and get a three-star on Master Saint. So here we go. The Witch is going to get taken out, hopefully, by those, uh, those goblins there. The Witch goes down. The Skeletons are still up and running, but it's cool. So we're going to drop down the Minion Horde. Going to take out the Valkyrie and the Princess. Sending the Fire Spirits just behind him. Expecting him to maybe have some arrows. Yeah, he does, guys. But the Fire Spirits are going to do another couple of hundred damage to that tower. Taking it down to 400 hit points already. Remember, we are going for the three crown victory. Remember, this challenge is also best out of three. So it's uh, whoever wins two of the games is the victor. So here we go. Got the Royal Giant going in. He's got a Pekka coming down now. Going to send in the Hog Rider. On the right-hand side, just to finish off that tower. Not really too bothered about the Pekka just yet, guys. There goes the Hog Rider. Now, let's draw this Pekka into the center. Where my other towers are, we've also got the Goblins ready to take them out, guys. So, he's got the Archers coming in behind. We're going to drop in the uh, the Goblins to take out the Archers. Going to send in the Fire Spirits towards the Musketeer as well. So, hopefully, we can take out the rest of his army. There it is. Looking good. So, I bet you right now, he's actually pooing himself, guys. So, he looks like he's going to be losing this battle. There's just over a minute left, and we've got to take down both towers. So, this is where we're really going to start to push. Got to drop the barbarians over here. So, here we go, guys. We're going to actually... um. Okay, so he's brought in the three musketeers on the right-hand side. You know what? Let's arrow the three musketeers just to, uh, you know, confuse them a little bit. Going to drop in the... Uh, those as well. What, what have we just dropped in there? The minion horde. We've got the minions destroying the three musketeers. Check it out. They just ripped them into pieces. So we're going to drop in the joy royal giant. Now, I'm guessing he's very low on elixir. He hasn't dropped in his arrow cards just yet, guys. So the second tower looks like it's going to be going down very quickly. Come on. We can do this. Can we at least get two towers down before the raid is over? Here we go. Going to send in the arrow cards, guys. We've got it down to 264 hit points. So close. So we're going to send in the goblins to take out the prince because he is trying to go for that victory there but we're not going to allow him to do it we're going to take out the second tower there it goes guys second tower goes down going to send in the guards to make sure he doesn't even get a single tower inside of this battle and that is where it's going to end so it's currently 1-1 we are drawing but we are about to go in for a final attack guys one final battle where both of us have to use a girl deck so it's time to switch back to the girl deck. There we go. What is it? Deck number three, I believe. So don't forget to go down below in that comment section. It's a very close battle so far. But who is going to be the overall champion? Is it going to be me or is it going to be Master Saint? So let's just uh, send him the challenge, guys. Friendly battle, ready to go. And we will be back in a few seconds time. So here we go, guys. The challenge has just been accepted by Master Saint, of course. And we are ready to rumble. So let's send in the... um. What should we go for? You know what? Let, let, let's be a bit cheeky. Let's send in the three musketeers straight away to see if we can do some instant damage to the tower on the right-hand side there. The witch is going to get taken out pretty quickly. Two musketeers still up and running. Going to take out one of the archers, and we've done a couple of hundred hit points to the uh, to the tower there on the uh, the right-hand side. So let's see what's, what's it looking like so far. So we just took out his princess. Going to drop in the archers as well just to do a bit of damage to the Valkyrie before it does hit my tower. Level 7 Valkyrie, so we don't want to allow that to go too deep into the base. Gonna drop down the princess. I just dropped that on the wrong side of the map, guys. I really want to focus all of my power onto that right-hand side. So, so far, we've taken the uh, the victory, guys. But, well, we have taken the lead. Not the victory, sorry. 
We're going to take out the Musketeer and the Valkyrie should actually make it onto the Princess as well. And hopefully take out the Princess. Yes, she does. That Valkyrie is an absolute beast. So the Valkyrie is going to go down. Now, I cannot lose this because I will not allow my pride. I'm a proud person. We cannot lose this, guys. We have to get the victory. So we're going to drop in the Witch at the, uh, the back right-hand side there. The Witch is ready to go. He's got the, uh, he's got the three Musketeers going in. We're going to send in the arrow cards over there. Just to do a little bit of splash damage to all of them. Check it out. The arrows actually do quite a large amount of damage to those musketeers. So we're going to send him one musketeer. He's got a witch coming in now as well. We're going to drop in the princess. We could be in serious trouble here, guys. We're in serious trouble. No. Check it out. He's actually going to take out my tower using these two stupid musketeers. So we just lost our tower. That was the most completely wrong move I could have made there. So we're a tower down. 1120 hit points left on that left-hand side over there. Can we uh, can we manage to take out this uh, this Valkyrie? So here we go, guys. We're going to drop in the Pekka on the right-hand side there. Now, hopefully, the Pekka is going to cause him a little bit of trouble. Also going to drop in the Witch. Now, he's going to drop in the three Musketeers, I'm guessing, again. The Pekka is actually going to go off to the left-hand side, which is good because that's probably better for me. So here we go, guys. Here we go. We've got the three Musketeers and the... Uh, and the uh, oh, let's just do this, guys. Here we go. Three Musketeers going to go in on the left-hand side. Going to drop in the Archers as well, just behind. This could be one serious battle about to happen. Let's see what we can do here. So we're going to drop in the uh, gonna drop in the Valkyrie, hopefully going to do some splash damage. We're in so much trouble. We are in so much trouble here. We're going to lose both towers, and we've only just managed to get his one down. So let's see if we can go for the crown tower, guys. It's going to have to be all or nothing. Can we do some damage? There's only 17 seconds left. We're going to lose to Master Saint. This is so embarrassing. Master Saint, you suck. So here we go, guys. Princess is going to go down. We're going to drop the Pekka at the bridge over there as well. And there we go. The Pekka's going to take out the Musketeer. Yeah, we lost. We lost. So the Musketeer goes down. Let's just give a little cry face, guys. Let's give a little cry face. Everyone go over to Master Saint's channel and abuse him. So that is going to be the end of the episode. Don't forget to leave a like and, of course, subscribe to enter the giveaway, guys. And, of course, go and check out Master Saint's channel. There will be a link in the description box down below. So I will see you shortly. Have a great day. Peace out.